Hello, folks. Hello, hello, hello. Hopefully you can see me and this Wi-Fi uh, winds up standing up uh, for, for the next few minutes. I'm going to do as long of a debate preview as I can. If you guys have any questions, then go ahead and pop them in there. Uh, I'm just going to let you guys know. Number one, it is a solid 1, 13 in the morning here in Edinburgh, Scotland. Uh, we have a train tomorrow morning, so this is me putting in some extra work for y'all uh, out here in these streets to get this done, uh, not only for the politics show, but also for the contender, which we are doing our, our uh, second debate expansion. And I got a feeling that we are going to get maybe the craziest shit that's ever been said in a debate in this debate. Like, I'm just letting you know. Uh, that is bit.ly slash second debate, bit.ly slash second debate. And I will let you know that we already have one card that we know is going to go in that expansion. Uh, Hot Beverages asks, will they be blue cards? There will be one brand new blue card. It will be grab blank right in the pussy. Um, so you will be able to say grab 9-11, uh, you know, grab terrorism, grab cyber, right in the pussy. Uh, it's the first time we've ever done a blue expansion card. Um, and to be honest, I, I don't even know how to feel about it. We're going to give everybody the option to have it not included in the pack because we've, we've never done anything, um, you know, uh, like we've never done anything where it there might be a random uh, uh, a pussy thrown in, right? Like you know we've never had that, so uh, it's gonna be in there though. You can get it right now. Bit.ly/slash second debate. If you guys have any questions right here, then go ahead and pop them in, and we'll do as many of those as possible. Um, by the way, I'm also watching the triple threat here, which. Uh, WWE moved their main event of their pay-per-view to the beginning of the show so they could avoid getting murdered by the debate. And now Dean Ambrose, John Cena, and AJ Styles are are, are just uh, uh, tearing down the building there in Sacramento, California. Fun fact, I would have been at that show if I wasn't here in Edinburgh, Scotland. Um, actually, I probably wouldn't have. I probably would have had to watch the debate anyway. Uh, so, good. I'm glad I'm here. Bill's uh, binders of women uh, getting in the debate hall. Um, well, uh, yeah, you know, so if you didn't watch, Donald Trump did a little pre-interview, a little presser with four of the women that have accused Bill Clinton of sexual assault and have also accused Hillary Clinton of, uh, demeaning or not believing them. Um, you know, uh, uh, so, so there's that, uh, someone has, how's the, how, how the beer has been. Fun fact, I, I've enjoyed the beer out here in England, uh, uh quite a bit in Scotland. Um, but, uh, I, I do not enjoy the IPAs, whatever they call IPAs out here, eh, not IPAs. The American ones, still good. Lagunita still tastes good out here. The one, the Scottish IPAs, I don't know. Mitzilla didn't do odds for Pollard, Paula Jones or Jennifer Flowers showing up. No, 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 no. I mean, really, it's like, literally, the only one that's missing is Monica. And Monica would break the internet. If, if Monica Lewinsky reappeared during this show, uh, or during this this uh, this thing, I don't know. Have you had any iron brew? A friend sent me some once uh, for shortbread. Oh, I think somebody was was telling me about that last night. Um, did I go to the elephant room? I don't remember if I went to the elephant room. Uh, Trump's going kamikaze. Please get a full English Scottish breakfast if you haven't. Not only did we have a full Scottish breakfast, we had a full vegan Scottish breakfast. Uh, what are you doing in Scotland? Just hanging out. Uh, we're just uh, out here, London and Scotland. We're leaving Edinburgh uh, tomorrow, but uh, we're we're just trying to relax and uh, have a good time. Um. <laughs> Uh, Brooke Blanchard, do you think 420 will be legalized next year? Uh, I'll tell you what, I would love for that to be the political conversation that we have. Is this going to be a gutter style debate? Um, ugh, I, you have to assume, right? You have to assume. You have to, uh, you know, 
Uh, TM Picone says the opening will be about the Trump recording. Do you think that they'll get the Podesta emails brought up? I would almost assure that they will bring up the Podesta emails. Um, how's the collapse of the pound treating you? Pretty well at the pubs, brah. Uh, what are the odds that Mike Pence does this debate rather than Trump? No, nah, Trump's doing it, baby. He is locked and loaded. That is a fact. There is nobody that is going to have uh, uh, you know, anything else to say about that. Uh, Jerry, is Trump going to have a working microphone? Yes, I believe he will. Um, I, I think they're going to be mic'd up lapel-wise because this is one of those walking around debates. Um, yeah, uh, 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 Mr. Kapelke out there in, in Australia wishes he didn't have to work. Man, I, I wish I was able to like watch this on my normal American time because staying up into the middle of the night to watch this just really makes it all the more depressing. Um, I think any of the people asking questions will go rogue. In this election, uh, uh, DM Picone, uh, I mean, what, what else? Would it shock you? Would it shock you? Do you think that the Germans might be a debate uh, that decides the election, given how net they normally don't? Uh, will the moderator be powerless again? Uh, oh no, we did not do the modern art gallery. Uh, do no, I think the moderator. I mean, Anderson Cooper, I think, is probably more of a forceful person. Nobody wants to be the moderator. Should never be the center of a debate. So that's why they will let themselves get run over, as opposed to interjecting themselves in in a way that they find you know uh, makes them unduly part of it. Uh, what are the chances that Hillary just says nothing at all and lets himself destruct on stage? I, I, I don't know if her strategy is going to be much different than that. I, I think that she's just going to try to look likable. And even if she is getting beaten up on, she's going to try to look likable. Um, like, literally, I, I can't remember. Here are things that I have no precedent for in my my personal knowledge that I've lived through, right? I mean, obviously you go back to like, ma, ma, where's my pa down in the White House? Ha, ha, ha. Like things got really personal during these, uh, th these here presidential elections back in the day. So we are not dealing with something that's never happened before. But in my lifetime, I've never seen anything get this dirty, this late in the game, you know? Um, you know, it, it's... I don't think this is really even about winners and losers. This election, as it's kind of been since he came into the race, or this debate is about Trump. It's not even about Hillary. It's about what Trump will do. He has made himself, win, lose, or draw, by the end of all this, the only thing that anyone has paid attention to, which is insane, because the second most unpopular person running for president is running against him. You know? It's, it's, it's just, uh, it's nuts. Are we heading to war with Russia regardless of who wins? Well, I mean, there's, there is a, a, a line of thought that says that Russia wants Trump to win because Trump will recede from the national, international stage. Uh, I have to give you props for predicting a landmine strategy from Hillary. Uh, yeah, and, and, and by the way, we don't know what she has up her sleeve for this debate. Because the last time she waited for the debate to talk about Alicia Machado. Um, John Droon, are you in Scotland? Indeed I am. I am in Edinburgh. Edinburgh. Um, but Pence wants to go up against Russia. Well, that's the normal Republican orthodoxy is fuck Russia. Um, that there's, uh, you hear that there's audio of Trump using the N-word. So now that people have kind of realized that you can just uh, go back to shows that Trump's been a part of and pull wild wild audio, apparently there is a, a apprentice clip of Trump using the N-word. Uh, apparently there's a producer that says that, that there's, uh, that, that that's out there and, and that the problem with that is, uh, you know, there's a... a a contract that says, um, you know, he, uh, he Trump can sue for five million dollars if stuff is leaked. So who knows? Again, man, we're talking about this election. Like, there's no rules 
There's no rules. In fact, really, the only thing you can count on uh, with this election is that the contender will be doing three uh, debate expansions. The New York one is already sold out. You have a chance right now to buy the second one. That is at bit.ly slash contender game. Again, bit.ly. No, sorry. Bit.ly slash second debate. Again, bit.ly slash second debate. That is where you can get our expansion, which will include grab blank right in the pussy. Um... Can I still vote for Dr. Bird? I think he might be America's only choice. What do you think about WikiLeaks will follow through about exposing Hillary or Assange hawking his book? Uh, I think they've already done a fair amount, right? I mean, they, they released the Podesta emails that were pretty big. In another election, those would have been a big fucking deal. Any chance Hillary Clinton states, uh, hey, look at Exhibit A, and then uh, next gotcha is laid out? I mean, maybe. Like, that's that would be the way that she did it during the first debate, so it makes sense. Do you think this is, uh, election is a circus? No, I, I think that this election is a, a, a freak show. It's not even a circus. Circuses, you know, have become businesses, freak shows. I, I mean, dirty, nasty, you know, carny, sideshow, freak shows. How could you let a maroon have the nuclear codes? I don't know. I don't know. What do the Brits think about this election? Uh, <laughs> man, I've tried to kind of keep it to a, to a minimum. I know that Will Harris is horrified. Uh, hooray democracy. Man, I'll tell you what, it's ugly. It is ugly. If Trump really is proven to be an orangutan uh, by Obama, then he should be eligible for president. Um, I mean, I don't quite know where that's going, but, you know, I'm down with it. Uh, two Count by Dean Ambrose, by the way, in the triple threat main event that is now opening the No Mercy pay-per-view in, uh, for, the, for, for, the, for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Only saving grace is Trump as if he makes our election of Tony Abbott in 2013 look positively sound. Well, hey, listen, man, if we're all in the business of, uh, you know, trying to, uh, <laughs> try to make the world look better, then the best thing we could do for you. What are your thoughts on Jill Stein with the Green Party? I think that her her her, her voting share will be down to below 1% by the next two weeks. Will there be a three-pack of printing for these contender cards? I missed the first one. It really depends on how well they sell, uh, squinty eyes. So, um, you know, the, the best thing I could say is, uh, uh, you know, try to get, you know, have them as they come out. Uh, can you share anything about your work with BitTorrent since the recent news? No. I literally, uh, here's here's all I know about BitTorrent is that I emailed them and uh, asked them what the deal was and I haven't gotten anything back. So what whiskeys have you tried while uh, trying to drown out this uh, election? A lot of them. Drink, drinking a lot of Scotch whiskey out here in Edinburgh. Can you explain why the Bernie truthers are retreating to Gary? Man. That's like seven crazy things ago. Realistically, is there any chance that uh, Trump drops out? Trump would need to see the advantage in dropping out. I don't think that uh, he is is going to see the advantage in it. I think that you know, um, you know, he's uh, he's he's going to ride this one till the wheels fall off. I think it's more likely that Pence drops off the ticket than Trump drops out. I can't imagine how an American history teacher might cover this election for their students. Of the two elections, the two candidates should come out to Bobby Roode's is glorious. Um, uh, I think that Donald Trump should come out to, hey, we want some pussy. Hey, we want some pussy. They see timing is everything, and the, the contender couldn't have been invented at a better time. Well, I agree, and everybody should head to thecontender.us to go check out the game for themselves. Uh, by the way, the second debate expansion, 10 bucks, and it will include a bonus card. There will be uh, the normal 12 cards that are in those mini expansions. The bonus card, that will be a 13th card, uh, will be the blue, politically incorrect, grab blank right in the pussy. Can we see any chance that the RNC pulls support and puts their own alternate candidate? They can't do that at this point. Uh, you know, Even the idea of getting Pence's name on the ballot in 50 states would be an issue. Uh, the question after this is, what do you do down ballot? Uh, yeah, no, I mean, I think that that's kind of the issue now. 
the issue now is, is, is all about down ballot. Can you smell what the Trump is cooking? Uh, yeah, it, it's, it's, uh, it sounds a lot like, you know, calls to savage nation. Uh, by the way, insane uh, top rope uh, springboard, 450 springboard from AJ Styles. Unfortunately, a two count for the champ that runs the camp. He's cooking poop. Do you think this election will finally lead to some election reform? I mean, but like reforming what? The, the, the person who was the insane uh, change agent uh, was uh, the guy who was you know, theoretically self-funding and didn't take a lot of funding all through the primary. So it's like, what are we reforming? What country will you be moving to if uh, if Trump wins? Nah, man, ain't, ain't nobody ruining. Y'all can't take the sky from me. I'm in America for the long haul. Uh, is the way that you can see Trump winning by next month or is this goose totally cooked? Uh, there's no point in which I will, uh, I, I will, I will say uh, that something is impossible. Um, yeah, calling women pigs, saying he likes to kiss them without asking. You know, when you're a star, you can grab them right in the puss. Bad Trump news or likely poor debate performance will this boost Johnson for the third debate? <laughs> no, I think I think Johnson's kind of faded on the national stage. Uh, which, yeah, sad to say for all the puff puff passers. Uh, I hate Hillary and Trump. What to do? Wake me up when November ends. <laughs> uh, I'm not moving, just committing suicide. Oh, come on. Come on. No need. No need for that. I'll vote for Jerry. Nice. All right. I'm down. I'd be very excited. Double AA right now. John Cena. Oh, wait. AJ flicked off. Looks like we're heading, uh, we're heading to the go-home. Uh, would uh, Trump do better if he acts more like a bald one? Um, <laughs> what's a national stage? Asked Gary Johnson. Uh, yeah, we, we, the U.S. survived Nixon. We can survive anything. We can vote Harambe. Harambe. You want to vote for Harambe? You're in Edinburgh, Scotland, hey. You want some brown sauce? Um, what do you think uh, the 16 vote is more impactful to its country, uh, Brexit, or the president? Um, I don't know. Probably the Brexit. Because the Brexit will probably last for more than four years. Maybe my guess. Uh, he should uh, run for mayor of New York. Can we vote all the scary clowns instead? Some people would say that we already have a few that we were voting for. Um, all right, guys. Well, I'm going to shut it down. Again, the contender, the game of presidential debate, if you want to pre-order all the best quotes that are going to come from, or the cards that will come from the best quotes tonight, you have to get it right now. There's no telling when uh, this will uh, uh, sell out. The last one sold out in five days. As soon as we make the orders, we make the orders based on the pre-orders, and as soon as we make the orders, then we sell what we got, and that is it. So if you want it, get it now. Bit.ly slash second debate. Bit.ly slash second debate. Big shouts. Let me give you all the... Uh, I will see you guys later. I'm probably not going to do it after the debate thing because it's fucking way late. But, uh... Eh, hold on to your butts. See you, man. Peace out. Yep, yep.